Hi, it's Matt here for Newshooter.com at Broadcast Asia 2014 in Singapore. I'm with Ralph from Lee Filters. Now, the GoPro is a very popular product. Just about everybody's got one. Now, you guys have now made filters for the GoPro. Tell me all about it. Correct. Yeah, what we've done is we've come up with uh, a filter holder system uh, with a range of filters for it. Now, there's the GoPro 3 Plus and there's also the GoPro 3. So we've got filters and a system to fit both. Um, I'll just run through the first set. The first set's the action kit. Inside the action kit you'll get the holder, an ND grad, plus a polarizer. And that's obviously for action shots. It's great for um, skiing, great for cycling, all the things that the GoPro's good at, this works well with. So, the, so for people out there who may not understand why you need to use, say, a polarizer or an ND on a GoPro, why is that important? Well, obviously, depending on what you're doing, you're going to get a lot of glare. So if you've got the glare, put the polarizer in, then the shot looks much nicer because it's going to remove the glare. The ND grad will take down the brightness. If you're out on, on uh, ski boarding or anything like that, the, the, when you see the shot, it's going to bleach it out. If you put the grad in, that will reduce the intensity of the light of the, of the foreground and make it for a much better shot. And also, because this has got automatic shutter on there, you're going to greatly reduce the shutter, so you're going to get rid of that sort of horrible, sort of fast shutter, earthquake-type looking image. Correct. Absolutely. Yeah, you are. Um, I'll just show you the system. That's the holder. As you can see, it's uh, very simple to attach to the GoPro. You play your filter in the back side of it, place that on there, and just lock it off, and that would be it, ready to go. Um, the underwater one that we've designed, it's got slots in it so that the pressure of the water will come out, whereas some of them on the market are going to cause a problem. But our one can go down quite deep and it won't cause a problem with the image at all. So what's the importance of using the underwater filter on a GoPro? Well, when you're underwater, you've got two different colour waters. You've got green water and you've got blue water. If you're shooting in, under in green water, the clarity is going to be terrible. So what we've done is we've put in a magenta filter that would give that, that, that image a much clearer image. And the, the difference is immense. And it's the same with under the blue. You put the opposite colour on, makes a big difference to visually what you're going to see at the end footage. It's as simple as that. OK, now when are these going to be available and what's the retail price? They're available now to order. Um, the main product launch will be on Monday, but it's, it's, it can actually start ordering the system from today onwards. And the price for it, if you work it in US dollars, for the, for the GoPro 3 will be about approximately $60 and the 3 Plus will be up to around about $95, give or take. So if people want more information, uh, where can they go to? Uh, depending on where you are, if you go to our website and look on our dealer locator, each one of our dealers will be offered this product and the majority of them are already saying they're going to take it. Uh, you've got Cafe Photo here in Singapore, they're the first guys to have actually committed in this side of the world to the system so they're always great stockers for us so you can definitely get it here from Cafe Photo.